Welcome back to Dave Beach London, and today we're going to Mr. Sub, but we're going to have something a little different. So watch this episode of Rapid Fire Labor Day Takeaway. Oh, sorry. Welcome back, Dave Beach London. Today here we're here with a Mr. Hugh Fawcett. He uh, uses an iPhone, but he's not a bad guy. <laughs> so, anyways, Huey, I do yeah, have a question buddy. for you. Yeah, buddy. How are you on that plant-based food? Have you ever tried any of those plant-based foods? Oh, fuck off. Like burgers or, no, Dave. or chicken no, or any Dave. of that stuff? No, Dave. No, you haven't? No, I won't, Dave. Well, we're no, going to have a meatball sub today, and we're also going to try a plant-based meatball sub. And we're going to see if they taste the same. Okay. Which one do you want to try first? <laughs> the real one. The real one. How well, do I know which one's the real one? <laughs> well, I don't know. I'm, I'm told you can tell. So, you thought you were just going to have like a... I thought we were going to have some? a nice bite to eat, Dave. I did. I did not well, you know said, I was a fucking guinea pig. I think you said you wanted something exotic. Exotic, yes. Mm -hmm. Exotic, yeah. I like it. What did you say, buddy? African food? I did. Indian food? Somewhere down Niagara Falls with other food? Well, this is kind of a yeah, takeout session we have going on here. So, here you go. I do like the meatball subs. That looks like a regular meatball sub to me. How about you? Do we have a look inside? That looks like an ordinary meatball sub. Just a trick. Are they both plant and I'm, I'm getting screwed like Dipper would do? No, I don't believe so. I didn't buy them. Lou, is one of those real? Yes. One of these sub. <laughs> said, is one of these subs really a meatball sub? Okay. Well, let's try it. Let's, All right, cheers. I think this is a real one. We'll see. He does. That's not the regular bread. Is that like a cheese bun? Yeah, I like the cheese on top. Yep. That tastes like an ordinary meatball sub. Yeah, it does. Mm -hmm. Yep. I'm going to get some beers somehow. I don't know how yet. But this one's grilled. Do you think this is plant-based or do you think this one's probably a real one? I, I, I would never one. have guessed plant. I would have fallen for this. And I had fallen for it a couple times. My daughter loved this. I love it. Well, I'm not sure if this plant-based food for you is actually healthy. Lisa's stuff is pretty freaking good, too. It looks funny. It does look funny. All right. You might as well just... I'm curious now, Dave. Are you curious? Yeah, I am now. All right. I am now. So, there you go. That looks like a regular sub to me. The meatballs look bigger. Oh, that's not real. That doesn't look real? They don't look real. No? No. They look different. Oh. They look bigger. Yeah, but they look different. Look how darker they are. You know what I mean? They're much darker. They kind of smell like Alpo. Alpo dog food okay, a little bit? Then, then you go first. Well, we should do it at the same time, right? Okay, well, we have to, I think. I will trust your judgment. <laughs> oh. You have a much better palate than I do. Well, I have to agree with that. Oh, yeah. No, no, no. I think we well, got to try the other stuff. It's part okay. of the show. I'm so enjoying this one, though. You get to finish that one. No, 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 no. Okay. Yeah. You, can finish. you might like this one better. That's what worries me. That's what worries me. Clean your palate first, Dave. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Yep. What would you rate that sub at that meatball sub? If you had to give it a score out of 10. It's, it's good. It's nothing great. It didn't blow my mind away. It's nothing different than I would have thrown together at home, really. So what would your score be on that? If you were to give it a score? I'm like, that wouldn't be cool, so I'll say a 6. I probably would say a 5 or a 4. But six. I'm, I don't mind being cruel. I'm going to say it's a, a 4.8. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was close to a 4 or 5, yeah. But I would still eat it. But I like Mr. Sub, so I don't want to give him a bad name. Well, I keep a list of people that say bad things. Yeah, they probably do, right? You ready? Yeah, that's not real, Dave. Look at that. I never would have guessed it by, if you hadn't told me. Are you going to spell it first? No. No, no, that's more like that Hawkeye thing in MASH. Everyone used to do that. Everything, everything went through those. You don't like that one? I don't like that one. So what would you score me on that one? No, no, I don't like that one, Dave. <laughs> so you scored it up between 10, 1 and 10. Oh, uh, now you're going to fucking make me... Uh, I knew you were going to... See, I told you he was going to do this. Yeah, that's not very good, Dave. Did you like that? No, I, I would give it... Did you swallow it? I did swallow it. You're a fucking trooper. Mm-hmm. 
That's really but good. I've eaten plant-based chicken, I've eaten plant-based hamburgers, and you know, it's just as bad as all the rest, but I managed to get it down. I'd give it a 1.2. I wouldn't eat it. You wouldn't eat it at all? If you see me, I wouldn't swallow it. Well, you know... I tasted bad in my mouth. Please tell me that's fake. If I was on an island with Wilson, you oh, know, with a ball, <laughs> I would, I'd I would eat it. I'd eat Wilson if I had to. I get Wilson would go. So, you know I mean? there you go. Huey and I both agree. Plant-based subs, probably not doing so good. Now, were they more money than a regular sub, Lucinda? Yes, they were. What was a plant-based sub worth? Uh, $9.95. I'd be pissed. And a regular sub? $6.99. I'd be pissed. I'd be pissed. Because you can't eat that. I'd say, right, I can't eat it. I'd say stick to the regular ones. Hit, like, subscribe. Look for us next time. I'm Dave, and that's you. See ya. And we'll see you soon. Peace!